the hands during backstroke might seem like they are doing crazy things when you see them in slow motion. However, once you understand each movement and practice it, it will make more sense. I divided it in four stages. It all starts when the hand is in the recovery stage. It is easier to get it out of the water with your thumb first. Then, during the recovery, rotate the wrist to make the pinky finger enter first. This is the only stroke that doesn't have any gliding. So, as soon as the hand enters, you need to start the pull. The rotation should be quick in order to start the pull in a good position. The hand actually starts pulling before the shoulder stops rotating. Now, the main strength of the pull comes in the middle. The elbow should be slightly bent. At this point, the chest should be pointing to one side of the pool. Once the hand passes the middle point, the pool changes direction and does a little scoop at the end. This happens partially because the other arm is about to enter and the rotation of the shoulders is about to reach the highest point. Backstroke is not an easy stroke to swim it right, but there are drills that can make it easier. This is why I will give you my favorite drill in the next video. In the meantime, be sure to subscribe and like the video. See you next time, swim fast!